Take a look at these four cylinders. They look pretty ordinary, right? But watch what happens when I give them a 180 degree turn. What's up, I'm Packer and welcome to Mind Blowing 3D Prints. I bought myself a 3D printer for Christmas and I've absolutely loved it. I've printed a ton of things and seen so many more designs, but of all the prints and designs I've seen, my favorite are the ones that just blow your mind. So I found and printed 10 of these designs and I decided to make a video on it, so I hope you enjoy it. Number 1 Take a look at this arrow. It's pointing to the right, right? But watch what happens when I turn it around. Now it's pointing to the right. How is this possible? Well, it turns out that this arrow is actually not an arrow at all. In fact, it's just a skewed shape that looks like an arrow from a certain angle. This print took about an hour and a half and works best in blue filament. Number 2 On the table is a white cube. But wait, why are those shadows there? Well, it turns out it's actually not a cube at all. It's just a compilation of plastic that sticks out in weird directions. This is the weirdest shape in the world. It's crazy that if viewed from the right angle, it forms a cube. This print took only about an hour and there's really nothing to it. It surprisingly only needed supports on one of the sticks. Number 3 Gravity has temporarily reversed itself, which means that this marble can freely roll uphill. What? How is this possible? Well, it turns out that this so-called ramp is actually not a ramp at all. In fact, in reality, the marble is still rolling downhill. So from one side, it looks like it rolls uphill, but from the back, this is what it looks like. This print took about three hours and looks really cool in the gray filament. Number four. I'm holding in my hand an impossible triangle made out of cubes, but how is that possible? Well, it turns out they're actually not cubes, they're inverted hexagons. This print took about 5 hours and came out pretty clean. It didn't need any supports. Number 5 This is the impossible triangle. Why is it called that? Well, if you take a closer look, you'll realize that this shape can't possibly be possible. Which is correct. It's all about perspective. This print took about 4 hours and it came out really clean. And for some reason, it was really satisfying to remove the supports. Number 6 On one side, this print forms the word yes, but when it's flipped around, it forms the word no. This print took a little over an hour and for some reason it just didn't want to come off, until finally... And by the way, if you're wondering how a 3D printer works, well first it starts in the spool of filament where the plastic runs down into the extruder, where it's pushed along this white PTFE tubing into the hot end where it's melted and put on the plastic. This nozzle moves back and forth horizontally, pulled by a belt powered by that motor, and the bed moves back and forth powered by that motor and also pulled by a belt right here. You can control everything from this screen, and the printer reads files from a card which has all the designs on it and this entire horizontal bar moves up and down on this threaded pole, powered by that motor down there. Number 7 Take a look at this 3D printed sculpture. It appears to move its head around and stare at you no matter where it's pointing. A little creepy? Well just watch this. It's actually an inverted sculpture. This print surprisingly took a whopping 6 hours to print, because it required a ton of detail. Number 8 If you look closely at these stairs, you'll realize they go on forever and ever. But I'm telling you, it's all about perspective. This print took about 4 hours and it works great in any color. Number 9 This print was shown at the beginning of the video, and even though I know the trick, it's still insane. The way it works is that this print isn't circular or star-shaped, but kind of a mix of both, and from the side you can see this weird curve pattern which gives it the illusion. 
Here's another print, similar to the last, but when this one's flipped around, the six circles turn into squares. The concept for this one is pretty much the same, with the weird curve shape pattern visible from the side which gives it the illusion. This print took about two and a half hours to print in the gray filament, while this one took over nine hours because it also needed a bunch of detail which naturally takes longer to print. Number 10. This last print isn't exactly like the rest, but I saw it and I thought it was pretty dang cool so I decided to print it out. It's basically just a floating mug that's pouring out milk. And that's the end of the video. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like and don't forget to subscribe for more cool videos like this. Also, leave a comment below telling me which print was your favorite.